Our veterans put it all on the line for our freedom. But oftentimes, their battle comes home with them, whether physical wounds or mental disorders. In this week's Doing Good report, we look at a group that makes sure our vets don't go it alone. Scott Robert West wasted no time serving his country. I joined the military straight out of high school. I was still 17 years old when I got into basic. Soon after, he was in Iraq on a mission down a dangerous road in the middle of the night. We called that road from Zulu 10 to Tango 10, IED Alley, Death Valley. Living up to its name, West was hit by an IED. My buddies are sitting around me talking to me, hey man, you know, we're gonna be home soon, you know, we're gonna be back at home, you know, we're gonna be with our families. He flatlined three times as doctors fought to save him. From the time that I died, the time that I woke up felt like about 15 seconds. It was more like three and a half days. It, it, I remember saying, Lord, you know, that foxhole prayer, please, Lord, let me live, let me live. You know, I swear I'll, I'll do everything right. I'll do everything that you want me to do. And um, I woke up at Walter Reed next to my parents. He survived, but he lost both his legs. His career was over. I found myself in a, you know, again, in a depressed state, you know, in the corner, isolating, PTSD, self-medicating. Addicted, then divorced. You could see the the challenge and the struggle that came with no longer being part of something that you felt like defined who you were. Sergeant Major Lance Nutt felt it when he retired from the Marine Corps. Their lives are not over just because they may not be serving any longer. So he started Sheepdog Impact Assistance, getting veterans off the couch in parts with their outdoor adventures. It was a blast. I loved it. West went on one, and he was hooked. They started calling me the next day saying, hey, when are we going to see you again? You know, uh, when are you coming back? We want you to run a Spartan race. We want you to come to Yosemite with us. Finding a new brotherhood and a new lease on life. And when I found Sheepdog, I found myself, you know, giving myself a purpose again and basically staying busy, you know, and that's what basically I think what's kept me, you know, sober and clean. Now he's giving back, volunteering full time for the organization. The next Outdoor Adventures Thursday, veterans will get to do rock crawling and axe throwing. And these adventures are just one way Sheepdog helps vets. For all the resources it has to offer, just check out this story on our website, nwahomepage.com.